Dr. Patel's shift ended three hours ago, but she's still at the hospital, charting, returning calls, doing the work of three people. One colleague just quit, another one's out on stress leave, and there's no replacement in sight. This isn't an isolated story. It's happening in hospitals across America because we're running out of doctors, and it's about to get much worse. The physician shortage isn't just a prediction anymore, it's our current reality. By 2037, we're facing a gap of 187,000 doctors. That's not just a staffing issue, it's a public health crisis in slow motion. Primary care will take the hardest hit, with a projected shortage of 87,000 doctors. But critical specialties like OB-GYN, cardiology, and anesthesiology are also facing massive gaps. The impact is already devastating patients. Longer wait times, delayed diagnoses, and entire communities becoming medical deserts where basic healthcare is a luxury. Rural areas are being decimated. By 2037, they'll be short 60% of the physicians they need, compared to just 10% in cities. Right now, 76 million Americans are living in primary care deserts, most of them in rural communities. While some experts suggest these numbers might be inflated, even conservative estimates point to an undeniable crisis. The question isn't whether we have a doctor shortage, it's whether we'll act before the system completely collapses. Full video at Med School Insiders.